everybody, this is Oops Pa Katie, and I am coming to you with another fruit video. Woohoo! So, what do I have today? I have what is called an ugly fruit, U G L I fruit. And um, so, uh, ugly fruits come from Jamaica. Um, they are a hybrid of um, grapefruit. Uh, tangerine and orange. They uh, were found in the wild f at first and then they were cultivated. Um, so this hybridization or however you say that happened in the wild first in Jamaica and then um, they were very popular. People liked them so they cultivated them and they are mostly grown in uh, Jamaica but um, apparently they are grown a few other places. Um, anyways, so it is supposed to, uh, it's, the, it's the size and shape, can be the size and shape of a grapefruit. This one is not, this is smaller than a grapefruit, but they say they can be larger than grapefruit. Um, however, the taste is supposed to be, uh, it's supposed to have the sweetness of the tangerine. Uh, but one account I read said that um, they taste like a lemon tangerine. So anyways. So they're supposed to be sweet and tart, which is something I like, sweet and tart. So let us hope for the best. Um, all right, so I have a knife here. Oh, oh look at that. Mm. <laughs> and, uh, um, to prepare the, the tangerine, uh, or the tangerine, the ugly fruit, um, you can uh, peel it like you would an orange or a tangerine um, and and eat the slices uh, like those or you can cut it in half like you would a grapefruit and eat it uh, in it's kind of like in a bowl shaped thing for breakfast or whatever. Um, you can also uh, cut it up and use it um, in salads um, and fruit salads and other dishes like you would mandarins, oranges. Any, any place you use a mandarin orange you can also use an ugly fruit. Okay so um, it, in order to know if it's ripe or not, um, it says that the greens uh, turns orange. In this case, it's turned yellow. Um, and so that's supposed to be an indication of ripeness. Also, it should be soft. When you touch it, it should be soft. And um, so anyways, uh, I think this is ripe and I'm going to try it. So I'm going to cut it now. Cut it, cut it, cut it. Ding, ding. Oi, 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 oh. Oh yeah, oh, whoa. slicing through that baby. Okay, all right. Well, just looks like an orange, folks. So there's the inside and uh, it's dripping. Uh, they say that the inside is very juicy and the peel is supposed to be very fragrant. It smells like an orange to me. Um, it's lighter colored than an orange. It's definitely seriously juicy, seriously juicy. And uh, just wait, we'll cut her a little more. Just hold on, just need to get a piece that's like bite size. All right, so here is my bite size piece and, um, and I'm gonna give her a try. Mm, it's good. Mm. Seriously juicy, holy smokes. It um it doesn't taste like orange. It tastes maybe a, I think they're right, it tastes a tiny bit like lemon, but it's sweet, so it's not it doesn't taste sour. And it's a little bit tart. So um, it's a it would be a very mild lemon flavor, very mild. Um, yeah, I think this is really good. Mm. <laughs> Ugly fruit for the win, yeah! So I would suggest that anyone who likes citrus fruits and anyone who would like a little something different should um, definitely give uh, ugly fruit a try. I'm sorry, I didn't look up the nutrition information, but I'm guessing, since it's part of the citrus family, that it's probably very high in vitamin C. Oh yeah! So anyways, I suggest that you go ahead and give it a try, and um, I don't think you're going to be disappointed. And, um, and I'm going to finish eating uh, some of this up and I will chit chat with you guys later. Bye. Nice.